First Chronicles 23, 1 through 6. Now David was old and full of days. He made Solomon king over Israel. Now Solomon was granted the throne before David even died. And according to this text, we see it in marriage. But typically the throne would be given when the king died. But David kind of retired from being king, although we see how he's still respected because of who he is. He gathered together all the princes of Israel with the Levites. And these are his sons that he gathers with the priests and Levites. So his sons and the men called to serve God. Um, the Levites were numbered from 30 years old and upward. The age where it was typically recognized that they were old enough to serve. And their number by their poles, man by man was 38,000. So this is the total number of those who are at the age where they can serve God. The allotment of Levi was to serve God. So these are the ones that get that. And he's going to distribute it out. Of these 24,000 more to oversee the work of the house of the Lord. And 6,000 were officers and judges. And 4,000 were doorkeepers. And 4,000 praised the Lord with instrument which I made, said David, for giving praise. David divided them into three into divisions according to the sons of Levi, Gershon, Kareth, and Merah. So, so he's dividing these groups. He's giving them what they each should be doing. Um... Just as David distributed this out, God does that with us and gives us what we're called to do and gives us gifts and talent and calls us in because we're to serve God with our life. And instead of being divided, we're put together. We all may come from different areas, have different gifts, but it's all to work together in His name.